Alright, what's up? I'm Ayan and today we are going to be talking about Free Download Manager which is literally the most powerful modern and the best alternative to Internet Download Manager. So, the best part about this software is that it comes with no adware, no malware and it is 100% free. It has lots of features which may not be found in Internet Download Manager but I have not used Internet Download Manager for ages. So, to get the Free Download Manager all you have to do is go to this link and hit download button hit save and your download will be starting if you are using another software like mac os android linux you can get free download manager for this as well make uh, but this free download manager is not available on ios so make sure you keep it in mind well i i will also be showing you how to download and use free download manager on android in my next video so after you have downloaded the software simply open it up and the installer will continue I am using the install for our users say yes to the prompts and the installer will begin the installation process I already installed the free download manager that is why it is showing me that it was already available but still I am installing it again just to demonstrate its use and purpose Okay, now let's wait for the installation to complete. And now free download manager is now installed on my computer. So let's finish this setup and open up the free download manager. It is right here. Let's maximize the window. And also before using it, I highly recommend that you change these settings that I always do. Make sure it is up to date and go to your preferences right from there and change the settings to get the maximum download speed possible dark theme the good one also it does have a new user interface which i really don't like because it is available in beta only so i mean i am going with the classic theme okay so after this we need to change for download the browser integration extension so if you are using microsoft edge you can hit the edge button right here and the download and it will open up edge and you will get the extension immediately but in my case I am not going to be using Microsoft Edge if you're using Google Chrome or Firefox those options are available for you as well also I am using brave browser so I have to go with the brave option and hit add to brave this extension will download and now whenever you start downloading stuff on your browser it will automatically go into the free download manager and your download will continue however if you do not want to use it you can simply click on the extension and pause the downloads or enable if you do not want to download the specific website just pause downloads and stop downloads the options are always in the extensions so in the traffic limits i actually go with the unlimited option to get the maximum download speed if your internet is struggling you can change it or limit your download for number of connections i always go with maximum uh, i'll go with 50000 i don't know why it just makes me feel good so in number of servers you can only go as high as 20 so i go with the maximum number as always for simultaneous download i prefer downloading one at a time so i change it to one but this is your own choice but, but my favorite settings are these one did, which I am doing right now this is the optimization for maximum speed possible so change it as you prefer it does have remote access but I am not going to show you this time you can download from your phones and it will automatically download on your laptop I may cover this in my another video so so nothing to change right here now let me show you how you can use it first of all let's download something i am downloading windows 11 for this because it is a huge file and downloading it is a pain okay so whenever you do this selecting the windows 11 iso image file let's see how my fdm catches this download and we should also compare the speed 
However, it does have a very specific feature which I really love about free download manager is that it helps you if your connection is unstable or something is wrong with your internet connection. If you download stuff, you can actually re-download it without having to re-download the whole file. Let me show you what I mean. Okay, this is how you can download it. If your download is failed, you can simply go back to the link and download again. You will be given the option to download and skip. I recommend if you press the skip button, it will automatically resume the download which was failed in the previous session or whatever. Okay, this is how you can use free download manager. But what if you do not want to use free download manager and use the browser's local downloader? Simply pause the download and it will not appear in the free download manager. And your browser will download it, it with your, it, its own download manager or things like that. And download is not beginning as you can see. This is very slow. That is why I use free download manager instead of the browser's own downloader. Sometimes the internet is slow and it is not working. Let me just clear everything and download it again by refreshing the page. Let's see if the download is any better or not. Download accelerators are very good if you are into downloading huge files like I do. So free download manager is the one I recommend instead of the most popular internet download manager. So this might be the best alternative to internet download manager. Okay, so the download is not beginning. I don't know why because it is very slow internet connection. Let's go to downloads and see. Okay, this is here but yeah now it started and it is actually kind of a little bit slow but not that far away from the internet download manager speed but still fdm is way better choice than browser zone downloader anyway that's been it thanks for watching and i will catch you guys in the next one take care bye bye